What's going on, you guys? I'm here at YCS Anaheim. My boy, Asian Persuasion. We're here with, what's your name, bro? Kelvin. And what did you play? Uh, Toad Heroes. Toad Heroes. Awesome. Um, first of all, I want to shout out to UltimateCardsCCG.com. Hey, I got <laughs> yep. the hoodie right in the right place. Check them out. Yep. Check them out. Check them out. out. For my deck, I played um, three Shadow Mist. I actually wanted to cut it to two, but th I think three is like really necessary. Three Bubble Man is pretty standard. Three Tin Goldfish for the Toad. Two Summoner Monks. Uh, I actually wanted to cut one because I kept drawing it in two, and most of the time I don't even Summoner Monk into Summoner Monk. And I usually side out one. One Goblin to Berg. This is a Rota target, this is why I only play one, but Goldfish is a lot better. Three Mass Change. Three Hero Lives. Three Book of Eclipse. Aim decked. Uh, this is like one of the best cards in the deck. Because when you're going second, it sucks, but if, if you can Mass Change into Anki and you Book of Eclipse, like, they can't, they don't really play like back row destruction anymore. Like, no Mirror Force, no Deepers and stuff. So I just Anki, run over, search Mass Change, Dark Law. Mm -hmm. I like it. Three Twin Twisters. This card, I was uh, debating either this or Cosmic Cyclone. This card is a lot better because it gets rid of two, and sometimes I ditch Bubble Man and Instant Fusion it back. And if I have too many monsters and I need a special Bubble Man, then Twin Twister helps out. Three Instant Fusion. Best card in the deck. One card, Bahamas Shark and the Toad. Yes, sir. Two Pod Desires. Um, this actually didn't screw me over today. When I was like testing at locals, I kept banishing like my good stuff. Like the mass changes always came up, like me needing a third and like a bubble man or something. But two, I think it's fine. Three E call. Upstart. This would have been the desires if I wanted to play three. <laughs> yeah. This one, it's good and call the bird. One Regeki. Uh, two Psalm Strikes. I didn't play three because when you got Hero Lives, you don't really have much life points. Even though drawing this pretty early is pretty good. Uh, like paying the life, it can secure you the game, but I don't think it's like too necessary yeah. for strikes. And these two are Reflesia targets. I wanted to play Treacherous, but I ended up cutting it. And one will mm -hmm. Awesome. 40 cards? Uh, yeah, 40 cards. 40 cards. Alright. So, next extra you pick? Uh, extra first. Two Dark Laws and an Enki. This card is like the best card for Book of Eclipse to break fields. Because you, if you have a. If they make a Zulkin and a Crystal Wing. You can Book of Eclipse and then summon this to run over uh, Crystal Wing. And then uh, Mass Change this into Dark Law and run over Zulkin. One Acid. I actually didn't summon him at all, but his effect is like really good. This card, you have to play this. This is actually my only instant fusion target. Uh, I never had a moment where I wanted to use rare fish. I usually just like bounce it back if I had another instant fusion in hand. This card, the truth, best card. Summon these. Yes, sir. <laughs> and the Utopia. I actually wanted to play a, a Prime, but I couldn't fit in room. I'd rather play an Anki, but Prime can steal games. Oh, and shout out to Kevin <laughs> for hey. helping me get this card. Uh, one Castell, one Samurai. Ooh, I love that card. Yeah. Still I actually games. used this for game, like, once. I actually wanted to cut this for Prime, but I don't I don't even know what I'd do. I still want to play Prime. Yeah, actually. One Dweller. Uh, with Instant Fusion, this card just gaining 500, boosted your uh, Bahamut Sharks and your Toes, which was really good. Reflesia for the two targets in my deck. On to the side deck. I played three Dankos. I didn't play against Paleos. I played against Magispectors. This is the only thing he came up against. Yeah, Magispectors. 
two maxis. I never drew it. <laughs> Three system downs. This card, you have to play it. Like, I take out Book of Eclipse and I put in these against uh, ABCs. Because I'd rather draw this in a Book of Eclipse. Two of these. I wanted to side three, but it could like conflict with Bubble Man. But even though I side this, I only played one, and I never drew it. <laughs> Two drownings. Usually, uh, quick if quickings. I'm yeah, quickings. Uh, when I'm going second, and or actually when when it's game two and I'm going first, I take out both the eclipses for these because I'm already going first. Three anti spell for against. This card came up into the main deck a lot, like I sided it in. It's like pretty much good against everything, everything yeah. yeah. Pretty good, I'm surprised it's still at three. Yep. Yes, sir. We'll see how much longer, yep. So, any shout-outs you want to give, man? Uh, I have a list. A list, all right, man, yeah. man came prepared. Shout-outs to Fantasy PBM on RuneScape, <laughs> uh, Team Group Chat, Mitchell Martin, Team Jobber, Jolina, Brandon Wolf for lending me a toad. <laughs> Anthony and Rob, who actually inspired me to play the deck. Anthony went undefeated day one. Oh, man. Yeah. Nice. And Rob helped me. My list is, like, really similar to Rob's. Mm -hmm. uh, shout out to Joe for lending me that one super bubble man. And I have, like, the rest is commons. <laughs> shout out to myself, because people forget to shout me out. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like that. <laughs> and Trevor Johnson. And that's it. <laughs> awesome. Congrats. Congrats.